Hey, I'm Tony King from Zerion. Today, I'm going to give you an Epicor Clips tip. The tip of the day is how to keep backordered items from printing at the bottom of a ticket. To explain it a little further, when you have a large order where only one item will ship today and the rest will ship at a later date, Eclipse will typically list all of those other items at the bottom of the ship ticket. Today, I'll show you how to keep that from happening. I'll start with E-Term and start a new sales order. I'll enter a customer and item quickly and get to the header screen. At the bottom of the header screen, in the shipping instructions field, the arrow down and arrow to the left, I can simply put no BO. in the shipping instructions field. You can still put shipping instructions here below this line, so if you do have some for the customers, feel free to go ahead and enter those now. Um, hit escape out and process the order. Now let's show you in solar. It's the same process here. I'm just gonna enter an order and get to the header screen. Select the header screen, click in Shipping Instructions, no BO, and then enter in any uh, instructions that you have from here. Okay. And process the order. You can just close it out here. It might be required for a PO number. That's fine. Just close the order and process it. From there, it's that simple. No back orders will print. So even though I use very few items in this example on the sales order, imagine that you had a lot of items on the sales order and only one was going to print today, but you didn't want all of the remaining items to print as back orders on that ship ticket. As an added bonus, I'll let you know that you can also use the same no BO functionality within the customer maintenance program. So you can basically load that as a default shipping instruction for that particular customer, and it'll work for every single time that customer has a ticket with you. Very nice feature, but anyhow, I hope uh, this tip helps you guys, and thanks for listening. <laughs>